Bro, after that sad video of the G35 and doing no install, just sitting there talking, we gotta bring something for the boys. That big old box right there. They have to guess before, they have to comment down below what it is. It's probably gonna be on our thumbnail anyways. <laughs> okay. okay. Now we're talking. Oh, what is that? Bro, is this what you like sit on and eat? Did, did you guys already do the intro or am I just talking about this? Now you're talking about this. All right. I did order a wing a few months back, but when I received it, it came damaged in multiple parts because USPS is very terrible. They break everything. That's like the third time. Even the underglow. Time. The underglow is broken. I had to send that one back. So I still have cracks on this one, but I mean, I'm kind of over it. I just want to put it on already. It's all right. It's not that bad, honestly, for being carbon fiber. Yeah. I see little things here and there, but. We're going to polish it up, bro. What are you going to get? What do you want? Who do you want? For how many? How much money? Uh, it'll be like 450. Oh, that's pretty expensive. That's a lot of money. Hey. It was either that or that big ass one that goes to the small one. But how long did you wait for this to come back? Didn't we order it like three weeks? We were, how, how well, the you, second time. Yeah, you ordered it a while ago. Months. Like months ago. Yeah, for them to even make it. Yeah, it takes a while because uh, it was tax season. And it's um pay. It's uh, made to order, right? Yes, it was tax season. It was made to order, so everyone was buying them apparently. If you guys can notice anything different on Bruce's car, comment down below and he himself will sign a static sli sli slicker <laughs> sticker and send it to you for free. You want to also talk life. about what you had to return to? Some other carbon fiber thing which we're not going to get too into detail until it we get it. From China. God, that's why you don't order Dude, on they eBay. Package it terrible. Was it eBay? It yeah, that's why. But it was a good deal. So all we gotta do, as you can see right here, this is where all the bolts for the wings are. The wings? The wing. Oh no way. There's two wings. Oh, looks like it's just a 10 millimeter. Looks like it's just uh, one, two, three, four, five. On oh, no way. Six, you have to count by hand, huh? Seven. Hey. A problem I'm seeing with this setup is that the studs are in the wing itself, and then they're held on by nuts. But when you look at this wing you can see that there's holes so we might have to remove the actual studs but from this wing with probably pliers or whatever tools we need oh that's how you do it so uh what are we doing here we're trying, trying to so. pry off the wing without breaking anything all right and it pops off just like that and as I can see right here, I guess the studs aren't removable, so I guess we're gonna have to figure something out. What went here? No idea. Hmm. So we might have to get new bolts just to put on the new wing, but we, we'll probably test fit the wing right now and see how it looks. Your blaster looks like an egg. That's awesome. All right, so it's gonna go like this. You wanna grab it? This is how exactly how it's gonna fit. That looks like fucking wild. Seeing it on the car actually does look better than I expected. The only problem that I think we're gonna face besides the studs is the weather stripping. I think water is gonna leak through if it starts raining, so we might have to go to the store. When we do buy the bolts to bolt it in, we might have to buy some weather stripping for him so water doesn't get inside either. I will pin the best joke made about his car right now in the comment section. And I'll give sticker to the best that makes fun of Danny's car. Look at that, bro. Super stock. Super All stock, stock, huh? Yeah. No, M6 by one. Bro, I knew that. We didn't need to find the bolts. M6, bro. You didn't know nothing. We need something small, though. Cause it's gonna hit. We're gonna need something. Oh fuck, dude, they're all long. I feel like we're here on every video now. I told you to get down from the get-go. What the fuck is the get-go? You know State Farm? Three in the morning. You know Geico? What, what do you call it? What do you call weather stripping? No, I was gonna put waterproof cotton. One, the other part is, uh, dropping it does help. Oh, there you go. I'll drop it every time. One. You wanna drive home? It was so awkward in there, dude. Everyone just started looking at us. 
All right, bro. Broken maintenance wieners. Here, press in the clutch. Press in the clutch. Wow, what's wrong with it? Here, press it. Terrible. I will be MIA for like about a month on my build just because I am doing my clutch soon and it's going to be pretty expensive. It's going to be around $600 and I'm doing that. I have obviously an OEM clutch at my house. I haven't gotten a flywheel. Hopefully when we're down there the dual mass is fine because you can't resurface those. So if it isn't fine and there's hard spots. Pretty much a flywheel is kind of like a rotor and a clutch is like a brake pad so there might be hard spots on the flywheel and you can only resurface the single mass, not the dual mass. So I'll probably have to buy another one if anything happens. And then I also have an E60 short shifter at my house and all the bushings for the assembly. And I just ordered M3 mounts because they are a little bit stiffer, but don't sacrifice, you know, the drivability, meaning that it's not gonna be vibrating when I drive. Kind of like Martin's car, just because his car is a race car. My car is a, a rice yeah, car. Baby. What the hell? Hit him, hit him, fucking hit him. I'm over this shit. Hit him, go for him. Aim for the legs, 20 points. Aim for the legs. Oh. <laughs> He's trying to, <laughs> he trying to die. Oh, you're recording? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> what the hell's wrong with you? Should have been recording, dude. What happened? Your punk ass fucking jigs. Nah, dude, you break everything you own. Look at your car. Oh. We're having a difficult time mounting the rear brake light. Well, the third brake light. So what we might do is just put 3M tape on there. And call it a go, bro. It falls, it falls. It's oh, 500 bucks down the drain. Hey, weight reduction anyways, huh? Okay. Right now we're just gonna put the wing finally on. He ended up just using washers for the top. This is the outside view currently on the car. I feel like it's gonna hit, it, bro. That's so close. Woo! Oh shit, that's terrible. Yeah, okay, he cracked it. It's terrible, man. Yeah, shave it. Nice. Shave your legs, bro. Oh, what's up, bro? What are you watching? Oh, this guy, TJ Hunt. Hey, so look what I found in here. Martin's crack pipe. And penis enhancement pills. So we're pretty much done, we just have to finish up. But the screws that I got are a little too long. So I did have to use the nuts and washers that came with it. Improvise, I don't want to go back to the store. So as you can tell right here, let me get the light. I had to use that as a washer or a spacer. But this is how it's gonna look. There are a couple of issues that I don't like. This barely touches but you could pull it apart so it's not that bad so that touches and this side has a gap <laughs> <laughs> so to you need gap insurance yeah so to those who actually made it uh, it's not built first well. it comes broken first it comes broken then, then it doesn't have right it's not built right all the screws i had to drill into my pretty much had to drill into my trunk to get a line right because it, it was actually hitting harder i had to drill these holes out to go that way or this way so that's pretty much it. Let's see how it looks. I know it didn't fit right, but I think it looks really good. I like it. It's good enough. From the back. It looks like a little hat, bro. <laughs> this is where we're going to end the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you want Martin to do more mods or have any ideas of what he should do, comment down below. We will have the link for the wing down below. Take it with a grain of salt, though, just because... It might come damaged. <laughs> we will have the link down below for the wing. After seeing it ourselves, it doesn't look that great just because we had a first incident of it pretty much just cracked everywhere where we had to return it. We don't know if it was the, the mailman's fault or the company, but this one had a damage too, and it didn't even fit right, and we had to pretty much take all day just to get it right. But yeah, like I said, we will have it down below and we'll also have SoCal Garage Works, I believe. It's a Veloster, um, Veloster Parts website. We'll have that down below if you want to check out their wings because they sell, sell them too. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, subscribe, share, and we'll see you guys on the next one.